Hello, I'm Alma Snowen. I'll be presenting Hennigan. Sometimes lighter is better failed marketing campaign with a proposal for a campaign relaunch. Hennigan is the most well-known Dutch beer brand. The business was found in 1873 and initially focused on the Dutch market, but it was able to effectively enter other markets very rapidly. Hennigan is known all over the world for its distinct green and red star logo. They have 85,000 employees globally. They are present in 190 countries and they are number one brewer in Europe and number two brewer in the world. About the campaign, the sometimes lighter is better advertising campaign from Hennigan was introduced in 2018 with the goal of promoting the company's newest alcohol free light beer, Hennigan 0.0. The slogan, sometimes lighter is better, was intended to communicate that Heineken Light was a great tasting, low calorie option for people who wanted to enjoy a beer without the added calories. The campaign showed a bartender using binoculars to observe a woman who appears to be thirsty at the end of the bar. He opens a light beer and moves it in her direction before reaching the woman at the end of the bar the beer passes by a number of people with a dark complexion as the bottle of hennigan light reached the woman with light skin with the phrase sometimes lighter is better the campaign failed due to the clear message of what the brand was trying to portray a lighter beer with less calories. Instead, many people saw the tagline as racist, particularly it was used as a part of the video advertisement. Hennigan faced backlash on social media when they launched this ad. Many people accused the brand of promoting racism and a prominent figure, Chance the Rapper, spoke against this campaign. Hennigan quickly pulled the ad and issued an apology. Paul Walker revealed that the campaign was overwhelmingly negative and only 9% was positive. This also declined the sales in the United States. It fell by 2.5%. A survey was found that the brand perception dropped from 64 to 59 of people saying they would consider buying Hennigan after the ad was aired. These are the tweets shared by the chance the rapper. Hennigan pulled the advertisement in reaction to the criticism and apologized for any offense it may have caused. The business admitted that the advertisement was ineffective and promised to improve its internal procedures to prevent similar errors from happening in the future. SWOT analysis. Strengths are it has a strong brand image and is the most recognized bureau brand in the world. With a long history of quality and innovation, it operates in over 190 countries, making it a truly global brand. In addition to its flagship, the company owns a number of other popular beer brands such as Amstel and Newcastle. They are constantly introducing new products and marketing campaigns to keep up with changing consumer preferences. Hennigan has a well-established distribution network that allows it to quickly and effectively distribute its products to consumers. Weaknesses Hennigan's revenue is heavily relevant on the, reliant on the beer market, which can be unpredictable and subject to economic downturns. While Hennigan has a strong global presence, it has limited market share in some of the world's fastest growing economics, such as India and China. Introducing beer can be expensive and Hennigan's high quality standards can result in higher costs than some of its competitors. Many of their products are similar to those of its competitors, which can make it difficult to stand out in a crowded market. Opportunities the popularity of craft beer has been growing in recent years and Hennigan has the opportunity to introduce new craft beer brands to appeal to this market. It has a history of acquiring successful beer brands and this strategy could be continued to expand its portfolio. The trend 
towards healthier lifestyle has created an opportunity for Henneken to introduce new non-alcoholic products such as beer alternatives or energy drink. Threats are Henneken faces competition from a number of other well-established beer brands as well as newer craft beer brands. Economic recession can impact consumer spending on non-essential products like beer, which could negatively impact Henneken's revenue. Regulation around alcohol sales and advertising can limit the ability to market its products in a certain market. Increasing concerns around the negative health effects of alcohol consumption could impact overall demand for beer products. The objectives are to increase brand awareness of Heineken's low alcohol beer products among health conscious consumers in the UK by 20% within a six month period through e commerce and social media channels. Second objective is to increase engagement with Heineken's low alcohol beer products on social media by 30% within a six month period through targeted social media and influencer partnership. Objective 3 is to increase Heineken's low alcohol beer market share by 5% in the UK within 6 months period through social media ads. The KPIs for the first objective is to build traffic by driving visits to main website and social media pages and to maximize the reach by creating multiple interaction using different paid owned and earned media touch points. The uh, KPIs for the second objective is to create interesting content and to minimize the bounce rates online and to track the volume of sales made of Henneken Light within the UK by through social media ads. And KPIs for the third objective is to measure the percentage of sales made of Henneken Light within the UK through social media ads and influencer partnership and also creating stronger connections between social media platform and website to attract and retain customers. STP strategy, segmentation. We are going to going with the younger active consumer group and the older generation with dietary and health conscious as both groups want to live a healthier, more balanced lifestyle but are unwilling to give up on beer entirely so they can choose the healthier option. The target audience can be people between 20 to 35 who are health conscious consumer as well as sports fan by promoting races, champions and other events. Men are strongly represented as consumers, however, they are trying to get women's attention too. They are positioned in self as a premium low calorie beer that doesn't compromise on taste. Oh. Vincent is 27 year old. He lives in Nottingham. He's a social and an impulsive person. He works in a finance company in his free time. He spends a lot of time with his friends and colleagues at a local bar, very often drinking Henneken beer. He is into sports, loves listening to songs, and he is a creative person and he loves traveling. The second persona is Sarah, a girl She's 25 years old, living in London. She's a digital marketer. She spends most of her time focusing on a balanced lifestyle and also an influencer. She's into creating health and fitness videos for social media. The campaign strategy is to emphasize the health benefits of low-calorie beer, leverage social media to engage within with consumers and use data-driven insights to refine the campaign. Henneken will, will create targeted social media ads that promote the health benefits of low alcohol beer products and highlight the campaign message that less is more with Henneken Light. These tactics will primarily focus on product and its health benefits rather than the topic of race. The tactics we are going to use is social media strategy social media platforms such as TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, and influencer marketing. This new advertising idea for the campaign is seen, um, seen who 
This advertisement featured individuals who are fit and healthy while also enjoying the flavor and sensation of the beer with 0.0 alcohol. The new tagline is less is more with Hanneken Light. This is the GAN chart. This is the social media challenge. We have created a TikTok challenge, a uh, hashtag Hennigan Light Healthy Habit Challenge. This challenge would encourage customers to share pictures or videos on social media of themselves engaging in healthy activities or habits while engaging in other activities with Hennigan Light. To participate in the challenge, customers have to follow Hennigan's social media, also post their picture tagging us. The best and the most creative entries would be featured on Hennigan's social media channel. This is the budget. Uh, for social media and SEO, we have targeted Facebook for £24,000, Instagram £36,000. The average cost is £1,500. Average budget is £100. And total is £90,300. These are the references. Thank you.